Welcome to my card pick up video. I just went to Jimmy's USA and I picked out a bunch of cards from the 50 cent bin. So in total I got about uh, 14 cards here. A lot of them just for the personal collection. I am thinking about selling a few, but we'll see. I'll start off with the top row. I got these nice refractor kind of rookies, different uh, color parallels. No, nothing too crazy, but I was thinking for 50 cents. I feel like it's uh, worth picking up because you never know. One of them might be a star in the future. And if anything, I know I could sell a few of these for a dollar. Got this Jokic Monopoly card. It's a base card, nothing too special. I am kind of thinking about just selling it, uh, but it's the first year of Monopoly. And Jokic is like the MVP of the winning team of the final so i feel like that's a good card to pick up i don't mind keeping it for the pc it'd be cool maybe i'll sell it but this is my first monopoly card i ever owned i don't know what people think about that set i've only looked at a few of the parallels and some of them are cool but i'm not like the biggest monopoly guy but you never know it could be like a bigger set and then i got this vince carter yellow all-time greats. I thought it was a gold parallel, but it's actually yellow. Not worth anything crazy. Maybe two, three dollars. But Vince Carter, one of the uh, the all-time uh, longest, oldest player that was like really solid even in, in his older years. That was Marcus Smart, Avery Bradley. I really picked up this Marcus Smart for the PC. Uh, I'm not the biggest Celtics fan, but I do like how Marcus Smart plays. One of those tough dogs, Avery Bradley, just a cool guy for 50 cents. Got this Dante uh, DiVincenzo. He's cool. He's not a superstar yet, but I feel like he's one of those players that have a lot of room to, to develop. And he's already on a good, he's on the Warrior, so he might uh, have a couple good years in his pocket. And I feel like a base rookie for 50 cents can't really go wrong. Tim Linscum rookie. It's my first uh, Tim Linscum rookie card I have for fifty cents. Just for the PC, fifty cents really can't go wrong. Uh, I got these uh, 07 or 08 tops, black rookie cards. I, this is my favorite set because it's like the first set that uh, I got into. I mostly have the baseball cards of this year, but I feel like these are some cool basketball cards to have Al, Hor Al Horford being a star Nick Young some people really like him Swaggy P I feel like they're both really cool cards I really like Al Horford I feel like he's one of those underrated vets Desmond Bain Colin Sexton base rookie cards nothing too special but for 50 cents I feel like it's a really good pickup you never know Colin Sexton he could be another star um maybe like a Donovan Mitchell or type player uh, Darren Fox type player still got a still pretty young so has some opportunity to be a star Desmond Bain very young rookie so we'll see what he does I think he's playing a, kind of solid so has potential and a red refractor Jeremy Lin Brooklyn Nets card just a parallel for 50 cents I thought it was a cool pickup in addition he gave me a, a deal so I picked up everything for $5. I'm pretty sure maybe off this top row and another card, I can make my money back, which I probably will do. I'm going to list like maybe six cards, and then if it sells, it sells. I get my money back, and I get all the other cards for free for my PC. So out of all the cards, I'd say my favorite pickups were these three. I, li I just like these players for my personal collection. And I get them for this price. I feel like it was a really good pickup. Uh, I also like this Al Horford and Vince Carter. Everything else, all these young players, I think are they're just worth picking up because it's like really cheap. And um, you just don't know. Maybe they become a star player on a team or, or a really important role player on a championship team. That kind of like potential is... Uh, unpredictable so i feel like putting 50 cents down on a potential five ten twenty dollars i feel like it's worth it and if anything it's 50 cents and i got a bundle deal so i think it 
it works out. So if you watch this whole video, thanks for watching. I probably won't be doing as many card videos as I used to. This isn't my first one in a while. I've uh, just been going to the shops less, but still really fun. Look through the bins and uh, hoping, hoping to do more videos in the future. Have a good one.